What's the letter before L? <laughs> Okay. K. So we'll start with L, we'll end with K, and they have to take the suggestion of Art Institute. If they screw up for some reason, feel free to boo them. All right? Boom away. You guys got it? We give you guys ABC. Okay. 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 <laughs> Lacking character depth, any kind of true color, it looks like a baby puked in shit at the same time. <laughs> Not so loud, you'll offend the artist. Oh, offend the artist, oh, sensitive artist now. Please! It took him a long time to finish the piece with all the nuances of color and shape. Quentin McGillicuddy. <laughs> a pure hat! Right. Easily the worst painting I've seen. Right, right. Well, Quentin worked, worked quite a bit on it. He's uh, he's laying down right now, taking a nap. <laughs> Show me a nude, are you? Like I want to see this more inferior product. It's like it was chiseled by a hamster being mauled by a ring. <laughs> Take a look at the detail in the midsection. <laughs> the contour. <laughs> it's actually to scale. <laughs> underpants he is clad. <laughs> Jockey underpants. <laughs> Very perceptive of you. I'm not quite sure how you made that out. It's all the same color. Whitey tighties to some. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Yes, I can take liberties. <laughs> it is my museum. Huh? You must show me art! I did not travel from my country far across the Atlantic to come to Chicago Art Institute to look at this dreck. A giggling, posed naked man. <laughs> Quinton McGillicuddy, remember this? Zealots and peasants! Zealots and peasants! That's who comes in here. I get no educated people. This is, this is special. Art is in the eye of the beholder. And this beholder beholds this as pure dreck. <laughs> beholder, sneeholder. <laughs> you know how dedicated these people are to their art? They work years and years, not like some random little pedestrian walking. Can you out. please hold while you read my Wikipedia page and see exactly who I am in the art that I've critiqued? <coughs> Damn! <laughs> Reginald Parker, I didn't know you actually existed. I thought you were a legend. Easy mistake most people make because I only come out whenever the full moon rises across the equator to full beam. It happens to be today. <laughs> Funny, I've never seen a moon do that. <laughs> Gently it rises above the horizon. And that's the way that I entered this art institute with gentle footsteps. Ha ha ha! Gentle footsteps indeed. You clomped and clambered your way up to this place, and now you insult it. I tiptoed like a ballerina across what is here, which appears to be your most beautiful specimen in this entire institute. Jumping like that, you're no ballerina. Ballerinas don't jump, they fly. <laughs> Karate I jump, that's how I learned my craft. 